Hello, I'm Steve Diltz, America's Marketing Manager for Encoder Products Company. In this video, we'll show you how the Model 25T Direct Motor Replacement, or DMR, encoders can reduce your parts inventory, reduce replacement costs, and reduce lead time. If your industrial manufacturing plant is like most, you have a collection of AC, induction, vector, or inverter duty motors comprised of several different brands and acquired over the course of many years. To address the need for replacement encoders, you may also have a corresponding collection of spare encoders to accommodate each of these motors, or you may not, in which case you'll be at the mercy of the manufacturer's lead time, and for some brands it could take weeks to get you a replacement. Encoder Products Company offers you a simple way to accommodate the vast majority of your AC induction motor encoder needs with one encoder, the Model 25T. Now, these two opposite drive-in motor housings represent the typical motors that you'll likely encounter out on the plant floor. Most motor manufacturers have gravitated to these two NEMA standards with either a 5 8 or a 1-inch bore diameter shaft and those are available with either frame size. And some manufacturers use a different bolt circle for the tether, but our kit easily accommodates that. Now, when you remove the protective cover, you'll often find the motor manufacturer supplies a variation of these HS20, HS25, or HS35 style encoders. And they'll use either a 10-pin mill spec or a twist lock style bayonet connector and a single point tether. So, we've got a possibility of four different motors and three different encoder combinations. Now here's the good news. With one Model 25T and just a handful of parts, you can accommodate all of these. We put everything you need in one DMR Universal Kit. With the DMR Universal Kit, you get the Model 25T with two flex mounts and both the 5 8 and the 1-inch bore sleeves. And while the encoder resolution of 1024 and the connector pinout will meet the vast majority of your requirements, it's always a good idea to confirm both of those. Fortunately, EPC puts the pinout right on the encoder label. Now, make sure you have the correct connector type, mil spec or bayonet, and insert the 5 8 or 1-inch bore adapter into the encoder and affix the appropriate anti-rotation tether. Install the encoder on the motor shaft and tighten the shaft collar. Align the tether with the mounting hole and replace the protective cover if used. With the Model 25T direct motor replacement encoders and universal kits, you benefit from reduced parts inventory, you obtain a cost improvement, and you have the right encoder on the shelf all the time. And who doesn't want that? In addition to the universal kit, we also supply DMR encoders that have only one specified tether and bore sleeve. EPC also provides a wide range of motor and machine mount shaft and through bore rotary encoders. Visit www.encoder.com for more information.